Please join me in standing for the class of 2022 and remain standing for the national anthem. Be seated. On behalf of the Board of Trustees, faculty, staff, and the students of Blue Ridge Community College, I bid you a warm welcome. Graduates, I'm honored as president of Blue Ridge Community College to be with you as you conclude this chapter in your lives and begin a new one. Whatever it took to get you here today, I applaud you. You did it. You've gained the tools and the know-how to make things happen. You've shown the determination to achieve. Now, there is no limit to what you can accomplish. You did the hard work. Now you'll have the credentials to prove it. Blue Ridge Community College is a special place. This is a family. That's right. We are Blue Ridge, and we're education elevated. We are a family of faculty and staff who work tirelessly to provide quality education to our students. Our family includes faculty and staff who are loyal, talented, and have committed their life's work to you. This college and this great place we call home. 
they are to be commended. Graduates, I know without a shadow of a doubt that you will leave Blue Ridge a different person than you arrived. This journey has demanded a lot of you. Months and months of work, countless hours of studying, and maybe a fair share of tears and anxiety when things got tough. Today, it all comes together. This is a proud moment, and not just for you, but for your friends, your family, your scholarship donors, and your instructors. They invested in you, they believed in you, they hoped for you, and they cheered for you. So for all the people who helped you get here, and there are many, let's give them a round of applause. If I may, I'd like to say just a few words more about our members of the Blue Ridge family, our faculty, and our staff. Last year, we surveyed our students in the community, and we asked, when you think of Blue Ridge Community College, what comes to mind? The two top responses were caring and helpful. Two characteristics that can make a difference in a person's life. You have the best community college faculty and staff anywhere, and I tip my hat to the talented team here at Blue Ridge Community College. As we begin our commencement, I'd like to take this opportunity to recognize those friends of the college who are with us today. These individuals have supported the faculty, staff, and students through their leadership, volunteer efforts, and giving. Please stand as I call your name and remain standing, and we will show our appreciation to you by applause after all the names have been read. From the Blue Ridge Community College Board of Trustees Chairman Chip Gould, Kelly Leonard, Jim Rasmussen, Duke Woodhull. From our Foundation Board of Directors, Jim Rasmussen, Chip Gould, Brett Miller, Tom Murrell, Rick Wood, Carolyn Alley. From our Henderson County Commissioners, David Hill, Rebecca McCall. From our Transylvania County Commissioners, Jason Chapel, Superintendent of Henderson County Public Schools, Dr. John Bryant. Our community ambassadors and other friends of the college, Mr. Bill Ramsey and Cindy Rasmussen. We couldn't do it without you. Thank you so much. Let's give them a round of applause. I'd also like to recognize and give special thanks to those assisting us in today's ceremony. This includes our honor marshals from the student leadership of Blue Ridge Community College, as well as our sign language interpreters, Matthew Biddy and Laura Nielsen. Also at this time, I'd like to ask all veterans to stand so we can recognize your service and sacrifice. You've made it possible for us to live and learn in freedom in this country. Today, you will notice that many of our graduates are wearing white cords to signify they are honor graduates. These accomplished students have reached their graduation day with a GP GPA of 3.5 or higher. Please check your program for a full listing of our cords and their significance. At this time, we have a special presentation honoring one of our graduates. You may know that Blue Ridge Community College is one of 58 community colleges in North Carolina. We are the third largest community college system in the United States. We call ourselves the Great 58. There are more than 500,000 community college students across the state each year. But recently, one of our graduates stood out among them for her accomplishments and was recognized with the prestigious Dallas Herring Achievement Award. Mr. Dallas Herring, the namesake of this prestigious award, was an inspirational champion for technical education who worked tirelessly to establish community colleges across the state in the 1960s. That is why he's known as the father of the North Carolina community college system. Dallas Herring's wish 
was that community colleges would take people where they are, carry them as far as they can go. That's why class of 2022 Blue Ridge Community College graduate Para Lee Cox is the perfect recipient of this award. Para Lee is living proof that Mr. Herring's work is still changing lives. Just a few years ago, Para Lee wrote a letter to Blue Ridge Community College asking how she could become a student here. She mailed that letter from prison. You see, Para Lee was born to parents who allowed drugs and violence to be a normal part of their lives. In her words, she felt like a lost cause and ran away to unfortunately make drugs and the street her home. In 2014, she was sentenced to 60 months in a federal prison for drug-related charges. But what seemed her lowest point actually became her turning point. In prison, Perley earned her GED and took advantage of a non-residential drug treatment program offered there. Sharing her story helped Perley work on herself and realize why she'd made so many harmful choices. During this time, Perley also joined the prison's fire department, which built her self-esteem and helped her feel a part of something important. And yes, that letter she mailed from prison made it to us. Perley, if you'll join me on stage. Perley Cox has been a standout student at Blue Ridge Community College. Her proud instructors note that Perley has performed exceptionally well in the surgical technology program, one of the toughest programs here. She's now employed as a surgical technician at Party UNC Healthcare and regularly assists Dr. Keith Maxwell in the operating room. Para Lee broke the cycle in which she was born and chose a different path. She proved that hard work and determination can help you accomplish anything. We feel so honored to have been here to walk alongside and support her on her path to a brighter future. Today, Para Lee is receiving an engraved award and a check for $1,000 from the North Carolina Community College System. Congratulations, Para Lee. We are so proud of you. What an amazing story. It's now my pleasure to introduce this morning's speaker, Mr. Jim Rasmussen. Mr. Rasmussen is CEO of Morrow Insurance Agency in Hendersonville. His career at Morrow spans more than 25 years. He attended the University of Wisconsin, Madison, where he earned his Bachelor of Arts in Mathematics. Jim serves as president of Blue Ridge Community College Educational Foundation Board of Directors a member of the Blue Ridge Community College Board of Trustees, a member of the Henderson County Partnership for Economic Development Board of Directors. As you'll soon hear, Jim is passionate about his work and especially his roles at Blue Ridge Community College. It's my honor and privilege to welcome Mr. Jim Rasmussen to the podium. Good morning. My name is Jim Rasmussen, and I'm one of the fortunate individuals who have the opportunity to be a friend and partner of Blue Ridge Community College. I'm a huge fan of Blue Ridge Community College. I believe in Blue Ridge Community College, and I believe in you. So this morning, I have the distinct honor and privilege to spend a few minutes addressing you the Blue Ridge Community College Class of 2022. With past commencements, I would sit down right there. I literally had a front row seat and thus had the opportunity to see the smiles, the pride, the sense of accomplishment, and the joy in each graduate's face as they passed by. I saw graduates' eyes connecting with family I saw graduates' eyes connecting with friends. I saw those same eyes connecting with their favorite Blue Ridge faculty who made a positive difference in their life while a student here at Blue Ridge. 
Stay tuned for that incredible experience is coming in short order. So this morning, our time together is about you. It's about your challenges and sacrifices. It's about your successes and achievements. It's about your stories. It's about your next steps, and it's about your future. Your Blue Ridge journey began with navigating the ever-changing and serious challenges associated with COVID. We all know the numerous challenges and great uncertainty associated. Not one of us saw this pandemic coming. Fortunately, wherever and whenever, Blue Ridge Community College stayed open. Think about that. Blue Ridge stayed open for you. You all have your own unique story as to some type of challenge that you faced. Some of you missed spending quality time at family meals so you could attend class. Others struggled with coordinating and paying for childcare so that attending Blue Ridge could be a reality. Still others worked multiple part-time jobs and somehow managed to make time to attend Blue Ridge. And there were those of you who had to choose homework over spending time with family and friends. I could go on and on for that list of examples is quite lengthy. And it doesn't even address the multitudes of challenges that your families faced during your time here at Blue Ridge. My point is, every one of you struggled and sacrificed in some way. And as a result of your sacrifices, you are here. You were challenged, you overcame, and we celebrate you. So, what about your next steps? Listen to this amazing list of career opportunities associated with your next steps. Business administration, office administration, criminal justice, nursing, information technology, welding, automotive systems, education, horticulture, brewing, distillation, and fermentation, emergency medical services, surgical technology, cosmetology, computer integrated machining, human services, accounting and finance, engineering, mechatronics, pre-paramedic, simulation and game development, film and video production, college transfers, visual arts, theater, pharmacy, manicuring and nail technology. Can you picture all the various areas of our community? Can you picture all the various areas of our economy where Blue Ridge alumni contribute to and are a part of? Think about it. When someone needs their car fixed, chances are that you'll find a Blue Ridge alumni there to help. When someone is in need of medical attention, chances are that you'll find a Blue Ridge alumni there to help. When first responders are needed, chances are that you'll find a Blue Ridge alumni there to help. When you get your hair cut or nails done, chances are that you'll find a Blue Ridge alumni there to help. And when you need help with your technology and devices, regardless if it's your smartphone, tablet, or computer, chances are that you'll find a Blue Ridge alumni there to help. In fact, even where I work, we have three Blue Ridge alumni who are there to help every day. I think you get the picture. Blue Ridge alumni, and this morning, you in particular, fuel our economy and our community. Please take a moment to let that sink in. You are a huge part of our economy. You are a huge part of our community. And I suspect that you are going to be a huge part of our future leaders. Lastly, I'd like to share some thoughts about the importance of having a mindset of gratitude. I believe that one of the most meaningful things that we can practice and hopefully perfect 
is having a mindset of simply being thankful. We all have someone in our life who exemplifies this mindset of being thankful. Consider this. Their glass is always half full, and sometimes it's completely full. They are thankful for the big things. They are thankful for the little things, and they are thankful for everything in between. They always seem to make a positive impact in the lives of others. It is almost as if they are investing a part of themselves in others. Ask yourself, aren't these the type of people we all like to associate with? A thankful mindset helps us have a more positive outlook on life. A thankful mindset helps us have a more positive impact on others. A thankful mindset helps us see a brighter future. A thankful mindset helps us reach for that brighter future. And a thankful mindset helps us achieve that brighter future. When you boil it down, being thankful improves our lives. Being thankful improves our personal lives. Being thankful improves our work lives. And being thankful improves our spiritual lives. Here's a simple exercise. When you wake up every morning, think of one or two things that you are thankful for. It doesn't matter if it's a big, little, or in-between thing. Just come up with one or two. Write it down. And then after a while, review what you've written. I promise that you'll be amazed as well as reminded of the many good things that have already transpired in your lives. Lastly, find someone to thank today and make it a habit of doing so. We all have people in our lives that would benefit from knowing that they are appreciated. Give it a try. In conclusion, you have worked hard. You have been challenged. You have grown. You have built lasting relationships. You have had support. Support from family and friends. Support from faculty and advisors. You have sacrificed. You have overcome. You have been part of something special, and now you have great opportunity. Your family, friends, fellow students, faculty, and community are thankful for and proud of you. You are Blue Ridge, and you are amazing. Well done, and congratulations, Blue Ridge Community College Class of 2022. Will the candidates for graduation please rise? Dr. Leatherwood, these are the candidates for the associate degree, diploma, and certificate. On behalf of the faculty at Blue Ridge Community College, I present these candidates to you for confirmation. As president of Blue Ridge Community College and by the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees and the North Carolina State Board of Community Colleges, I hereby confer these degrees, diplomas, and certificates upon the candidates from the 2022 graduating class. Michael Lee Absher, Associate in Applied Science, Business Administration, Public Administration. <laughs> Paula Aguilera Johnson, Associate in Applied Science, Business Administration, Summa Cum Laude. Sydney Noel Allison, Associate in Applied Science, Associate Degree, Nursing. <laughs> Ms.
Peyton Darlene Allman, Certificate, Early Childhood Education Preschool. <laughs> Nellie Vanessa Arzate Garcia, Certificate, Business Administration, Graphic Design, Magna Cum Laude. <laughs> Laura Christine Edney Bailey, Certificate, Office Administration, Office Specialist, Summa Cum Laude. <laughs> Daniel Christopher Barrett, Associate in Applied Science, Information Technology, Network Management, Cum Laude. <laughs> Jennifer Lynn Bolden, Associate in Applied Science, Information Technology, Data Management, Summa Cum Laude. <laughs> Christopher Trey Bradley, Associate in Applied Science, Welding Technology. Tiffany Renee Bradley, Associate in Applied Science, Associate Degree, Nursing. Christopher Thomas Branch, Associate in Applied Science, Automotive Systems Technology, Summa Cum Laude. Ashley Brewington Bryant, Certificate, Early Childhood Education, Preschool. Cameron Blake Burrell, Associate in Applied Science, Criminal Justice Technology, Magna Cum Laude. <laughs> Desire Jontel Campbell, Certificate, Aesthetics Technology. <laughs> Paralee Sue Cox, Associate in Applied Science, Surgical Technology. Savannah Pauline Christ, Associate in Applied Science, Cosmetology. <laughs> Matana Glory Dalton, Associate in Applied Science, Business Administration, Summa Cum Laude, Certificate, Business Administration, Leadership Studies, Summa Cum Laude. <laughs> Christy Lee Darkess, Associate in Applied Science, Interpreter Education. <laughs> Shantiria Ironisha Davis, Certificate Aesthetics Technology, Certificate Manicuring and Nail Technology. <laughs> Brianna Dobbins, Associate in Applied Science, Associate Degree Nursing. Glenn Dudas, Associate in Applied Science, Automotive Systems Technology, Cum Laude. Claire McCurry Dysart, Associate in Applied Science, Associate Degree, Nursing. Chelsea Freitag, Associate in Applied Science, Human Services Technology. <laughs> Glenda Galson, Associate in Applied Science, Associate Degree, Nursing. Thomas Gilmore, Associate in Applied Science, Human Services Technology, Summa Cum Laude, Associate in Science College Transfer, Summa Cum Laude, Certificate, Human Services Technology, Summa Cum Laude. <laughs> Richard Michael Grissom, Associate in Applied Science, Associate Degree, Nursing.
Emily Barbosa Guevara, Certificate, Business Administration, Basic. Jason Michael Gunn, Associate in Applied Science, Fire Protection Technology, Summa Cum Laude. Rhiannon Tyla Hanners, Associate in Applied Science, Associate Degree, Nursing. Sydney Carol Interlichia, Associate in Applied Science, Emergency Medical Science. Sergio Angel Islas, Associate in Applied Science, Office Administration, Summa Cum Laude. Chloe Corpening Johnson, Associate in Applied Science, Cosmetology. William Johnson, Certificate, Welding Technology, Basic Welding, Magna Cum Laude. Yeah. Rachel Richards Karst, Associate in Applied Science, Associate Degree, Nursing. Ryan Seth Ligotti, Associate in Applied Science, Information Technology Support and Services, Certificate Accounting and Finance Bookkeeping One. <laughs> Brianna Marie Lopez, Certificate Early Childhood Education Preschool, Summa Cum Laude. Giselle Yvonne Lopez, Associate in Applied Science, Cosmetology, Summa Cum Laude. <laughs> Russell Joseph Knox, Associate in Applied Science, Mechanical Engineering Technology, Magna Cum Laude. Dominic Bobby Marzan, Certificate, Aesthetics Technology. Lauren Bailey McDerris, Associate in Applied Science, Human Services Technology. Heather Nicole McDougald, Certificate, Aesthetics Technology, Cum Laude. Wanda Clayton McMinn, Associate in Applied Science, Accounting and Finance, Magna Cum Laude. <laughs> Emily Morgan Messer, Associate in Applied Science, Surgical Technology, Cum Laude. <laughs> Caitlin Marie Miser, Associate in Applied Science, Early Childhood Education, Magna Cum Laude. <laughs> Justin Allen Morgan, Associate in Applied Science, Fire Protection Technology, Summa Cum Laude. <laughs> Jasmine Leanne McElveen, Certificate, Aesthetics Technology, Summa Cum Laude. Christina Daniela Nieto Lopez, Associate in Applied Science, Early Childhood Education. <laughs> Zachary Ryan Oz, Associate in Applied Science, General Occupational Technology, Pre Paramedic, Cum Laude. <laughs> Joseph Dennis Pittman, Associate in Applied Science, Welding Technology, Magna Cum Laude. <laughs> Faith Lenore Potts, Associate in Applied Science, Interpreter Education.
Seneca Cynthia Price, Associate in Applied Science, Associate Degree Nursing. Aaron Youngblood Rummel, Associate in Applied Science, Business Administration, Magna Cum Laude. <laughs> Jessica Saunier, Certificate, Aesthetics Technology, Summa Cum Laude. <laughs> Sid Anthony Shaver, Associate in Applied Science, Welding Technology, Summa Cum Laude. Carlos Alberto Torres, Associate in Applied Science, Business Administration, Certificate, Business Administration Leadership Studies, Summa Cum Laude. Miranda Schuler Trapp, Associate in Applied Science, Office Administration, Cum Laude. Elizabeth Ann Wall, Certificate, Business Administration, Graphic Design, Summa Cum Laude. <laughs> April Danielle Ward, Associate in Applied Science, Associate Degree, Nursing. Dakota Hunter Youngblood, Associate in Applied Science, Mechatronics, Engineering Technology. <laughs> Justin Keith Youngblood, Certificate, Automotive Systems Technology, Level 1. Samantha Yesenia Zaldana, Certificate, Early Childhood Education, Teacher Preparation, Summa Cum Laude. Needs to be able to see you. Students, it is indeed an honor and my privilege to be the first to call you Blue Ridge Community College graduates. As president of this great institution, I know that today is a statement of why we exist as a community college. It is why we show up for work every day and why this group of fantastic faculty stands before you in the classroom or works beside you in a lab or clinical site. We do this because we believe we believe in the powerful transformation of education, and we believe in you. Thank you, Jim, for your inspirational words for our graduates. You are so right when you say that a thankful mindset helps us have a more positive outlook on life, which in turn creates a more positive workplace. Class of 2022, I always close our commencement ceremonies with a charge to the graduates. These are a culmination of my life experiences and lessons learned that I would like to share. Make a difference. The time will come when you have the opportunity to give back to your community. Take what you've learned and use it to improve your life. But more importantly, use it to change and improve someone else's life. Trust in yourself. Anyone can succeed when things are going well. The true measure of a person lies in how one gets back up after being knocked down. Trust, trust that you're ready for the roadblocks that may get in your way, and know that without a doubt, there'll be roadblocks in your life. When you hit one, reassess the situation and your priorities and determine what needs to be done. Take pride in your work. Be an example of how to do things right. Be confident and know that knowledge and wisdom are meant to be shared with others. If you commit to doing something, do it with Blue Ridge pride. Lead well. Even if you're not the boss, you'll, you will lead in your career. Someone's looking up to you, watching your actions, and listening to your words. 
And it's what you do when people aren't looking that will make a difference. And lastly, carry the Blue Ridge Community College name well. Being a graduate comes with an awesome responsibility. As part of this family, share your story and talk about the great things going on here. You are now an ambassador of Blue Ridge Community College and we're counting on you. At this time, it's my privilege to complete your transition from student to graduate. Will the class of 2022 please stand? You may now move your tassel from the right to the left. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in congratulating the class of 2022. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your attendance. Please rise and remain at your seat until the graduates have recessed. <laughs>